Hello everyone, and welcome to this unboxing video for Ether Fields Fifth Player Expansion. Woo! So, yeah, extra player makes it for five. Uh, nice, simple expansion. I remember it not costing much. It's not that big of a box. It is the same space here as the core box. Uh, at the back is practically blank, other than some legalese and a reminder. You need the core game. So, uh, let's get to this. Also, this is gorgeous. Gorgeous. But that's kind of one of the reasons I got the game. Beyond, I really like dream based things, uh, especially stuff that warps fairy tales into a more modern form. I would have assumed this box would have been smaller and not the size of the whole thing. So we've got some, we've got the regular player board and I'm assuming is the awakened player board, some tokens, a generic one for the character, and then so now I understand what these triangles are. They are specific things involving the characters. Again, they have different images corresponding to their numbered version, which I don't fully know what that's for. I don't know if it makes it puzzle or something. And then we don't really have much else. Again, little surprise this wasn't smaller. This could have easily been the size of that. But whatever, at least it will stack nicely. Um, it does come with a storage spot and everything for all the stuff right here. So at least it will fit nice and not be excess cardboard, including some spaces down here. Another silicone gel packet. Uh, another one of those bases for standees. One of each of those colored tokens. Right, so I guess they're for characters. Um, then we've got two packs of cards. One of which is another do not open until you unlock secret mode. So I guess these correspond to the characters slash classes. And then a bunch of player cards, I'm guessing. I'm not going to actually open this because one, I don't know how any of these function. And two, I don't know what kind of spoiler stuff could be in here. And three, I don't want to make a mess like for organization's sake. But there are some nice simple miniatures. So there's the character looking like she does on the cover. Love that weapon. The pose is also very nice. And the only other one is her awakened, evolved, whatever form. These were not originally part of the game, if I'm correct. These were a stretch goal just to exist. But yeah, I believe she was intended to be part of the original game. Um, but yeah, really, that's that's it. You know, just two packs of cards, one of which I definitely won't open, and the other one I just shouldn't. And uh, some excess tokens and boards and stuff and two miniatures. So yeah, that's everything this time around. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, feel free to press that like button. If you think somebody else will enjoy this, feel free to share this video. Either way, I hope this video gets seen more. If you didn't like this video, go ahead and press the dislike button. I won't mind, but please leave a constructive comment as to why. Also, feel free to comment in general, such as, would you like to see this in more detail, be it the cards, painting videos for the miniatures, or just like a how to play, or a, you know, a playthrough, or something like that, or any of the other Awaken Realm games, or anything else that I've unboxed on this channel. And if you'd like to see more like this, be it more unboxing videos, my board game overviews, my painting videos, all three of which I'm willing to do for Awaken Realm games, Anything else that I might do on this channel, feel free to subscribe. Regardless, thank you for watching and have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.